saw yesterday, that bunker to avoid in the middle of the fairway, and she did avoid it. Get it all the way down there to the end of the fairway, but the second tough shot is the second shot's downhill lie. You, you really, it, you, you, you're playing a shot that is no more than, say, 230 in the air, because, you know, you've got to expect it to release. The run out is about 255 through if you take the downhill into consideration. So I come back. Just a little bit, trying to get it to spin nicely. A good place to leave it. That's a really slow putt, but not much in that. So good chance for birdie at the 11th for Lydia. That was before the COVID break, so. Lydia for birdie now at 11. There you go. Told you wasn't much in that putt. Good stroke. Well played hole. It is actually under par for today, as opposed to yesterday where it was over par, just on average for the field. Yeah, it's still early. Hardly took any sound. That is only Lydia can even see that shot, Karen. Right now, she's sitting 64% at 128. So accuracy, yes, gone, but she's gained 10 yards. Pretty good. No other player could have left that short and on the green. Oh, no, that was very, very good. You're not very far for par here at 13 either. No, two incredible up and downs in a row if this goes in. Mm. Of course it does. Yeah, when you get a short game like that, can make up for a little bit of wayward drives. However, it doesn't last long. It's fantastic. Lydia Ko just trying to work that magic again, going to the well with a short game one more time, and look hey, here. Doesn't it sound so good? And she's really stroking it well. These are nearly automatic for Lydia. Yep, good call. She's got to get that golf swing settled down here. Got to hit some fairways, give herself some opportunities. You can't be trying to make pars around this golf course and make a run. This one's on a really good line. Yeah, I'd say. Might yeah, go in. You might go in. Perfect line. Tap in. That's a quality iron shot. <laughs> She could actually practice, oh, good looking shot. Jim, she could practice that from the putting surface without touching the grass. Yeah. It's just uncanny. Yeah. Well, especially now when you can tap down yeah, spike marks and things, it's. <laughs> it's a nice story. Austin Ernst met her fiance.